When Trump rolls out his budget proposals, one thing that really stands out to some Americans is the fact that he would like to eliminate all funding for the arts, specifically the National Endowment for the Arts. The Heritage Foundation thinks that it should be defunded. A lot of conservatives think it's a waste of taxpayer money. And so a criticism you hear a lot from the right in regard to the left is that they want taxpayer funded art and it's not fair, money should not go toward that. Now Sean Hannity wanted to make that point by highlighting a conservative artist and then asking whether or not liberals would like their taxpayer money to go toward that form of art. Now the artist is Jim McNaughton and he recently painted an image that kind of he felt passionately about because of the NFL kneeling protests. Now I don't want to put words in his mouth, I want you to hear from the artist himself and then we'll put Hannity in the mix. Take a look. Football season, we witnessed the NFL players kneeling to the national anthem. And I don't know about you, but it just really offended me when I considered what that flag represents and the way that the NFL supported those players and letting them do that. So when President Trump chose to speak out against their actions, a lot of people said, well, that's unbecoming of a president. He shouldn't do that. My opinion is it is exactly what a president should do, to stand up for American values. For that, I cheer him. And in my mind, I envisioned the president standing on a football field after he's picked up a shredded, trampled, grass-stained American flag and he holds it up to his chest and he attempts to clean it with a rag. Okay. Okay. Wait a minute. Okay. First of all, I was I had seen a smaller picture uh, version of that picture, and I was like, why is the president using the American flag as his blankie? Okay. Then there's he has an actual blankie as well. Yeah. It's, it's weird. What a weird picture of like like oh. Okay. 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 So so let me explain the the painting a little bit. Um, Yes, he has a tattered flag and then he has what appears to be a blankie in his other hand and he's kind of holding everything together. Um, it's actually a rag that he's using to clean the flag. That's that's what the- <laughs> If you the say so, said. man, my so, daughter has a blankie just like that. Uh, by the way, I think this this art is fine. It's political art, you know, he has beliefs that I don't agree with, but do you boo? You know, I'm not hating on him. This is what he feels passionately about. This is how he expresses it. I'm fine with that, that's fine. Okay. okay. So Again, we disagree, but the story gets better. So, okay, before we get to the fun stuff, look, Hannity thinks he's being clever and proving a point, yeah. right? Like, so what? Yeah, I mean, if that was the official portrait of Trump, of course we'd pay for it. Every president is an official portrait, right? If and and if it was accepted in whatever process that people use to for the endowment of the arts, then of course we'd pay for it, and and so. Like he thinks that we're a special snowflake like him. Exactly. If he saw a thing like that of Obama, he'd be like, "Oh my God, my feelings are hurt." I think it's a funny picture of the president holding a blankie. Okay. <laughs> so what? And by the way, art is is supposed to be up for interpretation. So that's yeah. your interpretation. Again, <laughs> to the artist, you do you do you boo, and same to you, Jake. All right. Okay. So now, what did Sean Hannity do, and what was the response? This is the part that I absolutely love. So he tweets that video that we just showed you and he includes the message, the left loves art and especially taxpayer funded art that is provocative. Let's get their reaction to this. So I, of, I'm sorry, just I'm sorry Anna. Look, I think there's some chance McNaughton is trolling Trump. He looks like the baby that he is in that picture. I mean, sad baby. I, I mean, he acts like a petulant child and the guy has him holding not one but two blankies. It's not it's not a far-fetched idea. I mean, it, for me I'll fund it right now. For me it's you want me to do a GoFundMe? <laughs> For me, it's not even that Trump is holding the flag and that rag as if they're blankies. It's the expression on his face. He looks dazed and confused. <laughs> so, okay. Which makes sense. All right. Now, the reaction to Hannity. By the way, can we put Hannity's tweet up again? I don't know why left is in quotation marks. I don't know why provocative. So, is he talking about the left? <laughs> and is he saying provocative, like sincerely? I, I don't know what any of this means. But here's the reaction to it, which is what I I absolutely loved. So Chris Hayes I, it had my favorite reaction. He was like, this is literally the most beautiful thing I've ever seen. Thank you for sharing. <laughs> because <laughs> unlike the like the really angry uh, bitter right, we actually have a 
sense of humor. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so um, John Novak uh, had my second favorite tweet. Looks like the American flag might have a $130,000 check from Michael Cohen coming her way. Oh, Jesus, what have you done? Yeah, <laughs> but it's kind of true. Yeah, I um, thought it was gonna be the 22nd person that came forward. <laughs> <laughs> Let's hear from Sarah. Uh, Sarah tweeted, TFW, you don't know how to clean a flag, because he looks dazed and confused. The feels when, that's what TFW stands for. Another uh, tweeter wrote, he looks disoriented, scared, and possibly like he's had a stroke. This artist is a genius who has captured the true essence of Trump. But I'm just like, I kind of think so. I do. I don't know if he meant it or if it was subconscious or he's trolling him, but I would make that the official portrait of Trump. It's just, it's too good. And then one more, one more tweet. New John uh, McNaughton painting, bewildered old man wanders onto football field <laughs> carrying his blanket, 2008. <laughs> yeah, I didn't even see that. <laughs> <laughs> totally, that's exactly what that picture is. Anyway. And of course, people then uh, took out the American flag, put in a Russian flag. Yeah, that was another <laughs> one. So um, I love the reaction to it. And I'm not a huge fan of these like Twitter beefs and like, oh yeah, you got told on Twitter. But this was, <laughs> this was funny. You got funny. told. <laughs> you got Twitter. told. If you want to get the whole Young Turks show every single day, become a member, tytnetwork.com slash join. And once you do, you'll be saying, you know, I'm like a smart person. Or you might say, I think it's weird. Or you might say, oops. No, that won't be that one. It won't be that one. It'll be great, trust me. TYTnetwork.com slash join.